off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Ignore the laundry we're working on this morning um, but I have this cute little gift that I've got here for a friend. She got some pretty bad news the other day and uh, wanted to take her a little pick-me-up gift. Hang on. And it's near our store. So Jason and I are both going to drive up there. I'm going to go see the new office for the first time and um, get some new shoes. I need some more, some like regular around, around town shoes. I need to transition out of my flip flops. Can you either come get my water or this bag? Which one do you want to take, the water or the bag? I'll let you put that in there because it falls okay. over, so. Okay, you can just take that, that'd be great. I got it. Yeah. Um, I just need around town shoes. Um, I drive, you drive it? What would ease your tension right now? Because I'm not sure why your little sphincter is tight right now. I'm not tense. Okay, let's get the stuff out of the car. Well, the oatmeal didn't do the trick, so. <laughs> you have the camera, so not anything. <laughs> he just said what he wanted to say off camera, and it, yeah, he can't say that on camera. It's not bad. Don't make it look like it's bad. It's not. No, it's not bad. I just, I literally can't say it on camera. But I need that seat put up. I just didn't have a hand to do it, which is why I didn't want you to. <laughs> I need you to help me put the seat up. Okay, got that packed in here. Didn't did rain last night, but it isn't going to rain today, which is good news, because tonight I have to go to the haunted house, the haunted forest. Do you guys remember a couple years ago? <laughs> I never le remember to leave the links for videos down below. So just go check out Haunted Forest on my channel. <laughs> no, I just never remember to do it. They're all they're all listed. I have to go and I say I have to go because I vowed after that first time going to the Haunted Forest, I would never go again. I don't like being scared. I don't like Halloween. I don't like people with masks on and I don't like being in dark woods at night. So it's just like a recipe for disaster. Um, and so on Sunday, the person who puts on the whole haunted forest, he has upped his game and he now has um, a charity, not a charity. Yeah, just, no, they've raised it, almost $10,000 for children, uh, Children's Hospital. Yeah, children, Seattle Children's Hospital. Seattle Children's Hospital. Yeah. So he's really trying to up it, created a website, wants to create a video to advertise for it, especially for next year. He has clips of the video I did from last time um, on the website to kind of entice people, but he wants me to make a full video. Just a video they can use to promote it. Yeah, and then he'll chop it up if he needs to, but like, he's, and I, and then I, I was like, oh yeah, I'll do that. And then I realized what he was doing. He's like, ha ha, I got you. You have to go through again. That's tonight, which is why I'm glad it's not gonna be rainy. Um, so I can film it. So that's tonight, but for now, um, let's drive up, give this gift, which we're not going to film. That's like their private situation, but we'll go up to the store and I will give you a first hand account of the office from my perspective. I think it's, it looks great on camera. Yeah. It's Why nice. are you so like, I'm going to, I'm going to let the music, we need to turn on some sphincter I'm, release I'm music. Fine. I'm fine. I don't. I'm listening to you. Yeah, no, it's really nice. Okay. Back in the Do you ever feel you don't get out what you're putting in? All your hopes and efforts are all in vain. Who will pick you up when you've lost everything? here at this store. I just decided to come here first. Um, 
this was such a mess before he's always been cautious of having wanting to have a desk here because he thought it would be in the way but his boxes were stacked with junk all across this whole wall and you could never do anything with it anyway this is so cute this is this is our manager's new desk this is cute it wasn't junk it was records yeah whatever it, whatever. This is nice. Does she have like her own little computer that she uses or something? Uh, she says she's bringing the little, little laptop that she has. Nice. This is cute. Oh, and then this is what came um, to our house. I don't know why it was shipped to our house. It was in the order with like everything else. Um, but I'm glad that they got that. It has a cute little stand on it. Um, oh, is it broken? Maybe they can't figure out how to install it. But anyway. Um, and then here is his nice desk setup. I'm seeing this for the first time with you guys. I'm checking to make sure that there's no <laughs> information on his desk. Um, so I wanted to like show some of these details. So these are Tesla photos. These are like, like the, you know, the structure of how Teslas are made. And she found those cool photos and got those printed. And then she took these photos from our Facebook page. This is Hawaii last year. You can see Jacob and then our professional ones that we had done. That's our staff. We went to Seattle last year. Um, there's the girls on the pier in Lahaina, but now it's gone. That's again, the same trip here. That was the Chihuly Gardens. And then that one is our trip that we just went on. How fun. She pulled that one um, from our very most recent hike or most recent trip. This is a picture of Jason hiking down in Southern Utah and biking. Do you know where that was at? Is that in yeah, Alaska? Yeah, in Alaska. All right. And then um, our, our manager's um, husband got these for Jason. They're little Star Wars bubbles. <laughs> um, just because she is cool like that and they went and found those for him. Those are actually really cool. I know, they are cool. Um, yeah. Anyway, and do you like that little setup there? Oh yeah. No, it's like nice. having that riser is nice, isn't it? Yeah, I guess the screen. Yeah, nice well, just like gets it up and out of the way and stuff. And I can fill this with like lots of little pieces of paper. Because that's your favorite thing. I am shocked that there's only one little piece. That's a check. Yeah. But that, well, there's a card. But oh, there's the little there's a little that, sticky. So it, I can remember the... Anyway, this is a oh that's from Kaylee. That's from a long time ago then. Yeah. That's cute. Um. It should be up here. Did it? Yeah. Anyway. Fun office. Um, this painting is. Did we buy it? Did your mom buy it? I don't remember. But no, I bought it from a dude uh, that was going around selling paintings. Both that and that. That is uh, in New Zealand. It is. Um, oh gosh, how can I forget the mountain there? The tallest mountain in New Zealand. And then obviously that's Yosemite. Oh yeah, I, I didn't show that one yet. That one's Yosemite, but they haven't been hung, ever. <laughs> <laughs> no, that one was actually over here. Was it? Yeah. Actually hung? Yes. And then I'm glad you brought this in. I, this has been on the counter. Um, this is the painting Chelsea did. This is literally how he had to be told that we were going to Hawaii. Because um, we were like, that's me and you on Diamond Head, and that's where we're going to be on your birthday. So I'm glad you brought that. Maybe we'll stick that on the wall somewhere. It's kind of cute. Yeah. Okay, there's a customer out there, so I don't want him to be weirded out with me pulling my camera out. I'm trying these shoes on. I'm not going to get white <laughs> for the winter, but I'm trying these on. And the problem that I have, I really like them. These are Birkenstocks, which is so strange. I've never seen them do like the lace-ups like this, but they're really comfortable. Um, they're working on me. I had this one on first, and I was like, well, I have to try both of them on because I have two different size feet. And this one feels so much better <laughs> because this is my smaller foot. Um, so I'm kind of wondering, I don't think Birkenstocks do half sizes, my only worry. But I want to, I don't know if I have to, I just keep wanting to fidget with this toe to make it fit. So I have to just decide, he would just get them in black for me. Um, and then they have the white sole, the creamy sole like this. And then it's like this cork um, with, that Birkenstock is known for. So there's some Clarks that I was also trying on, but I don't think they're going to work because they're too narrow in the footbed. I don't know, but they're kind of giving like Converse vibes, you know, little Puma or whatever. Also, look at my fun little fallish um, 
palm tree scene that I found uh, for my watch. <laughs> the, I love having my beach scene, but it was a little, a little much this late in the season. So we went for fall colors and palm trees. I don't know, I'm trying to decide. Jason, of course, has gotten himself working <laughs> now that we're here, which is why we live so far away from the store. That was the agreement when we bought this store 20 years ago, is that we can't live close to it because I knew he would just be here all the time. He is already, but um, when I knew he needed to have enough of a drive to get there to make it a, have to be a conscious decision to come in, um, but also far enough away that like you're gonna stay home when you're home. Um, it was a wise choice. So I'm gonna walk around with these shoes on in here and decide, but I'm gonna put my camera away for a second um, so that they're not weirded out by it. I just noticed something. He has his own shoe rack. You guys, this is the thing. He wears shoes in the car and then he has his work shoes to wear when he's here, but then they have to air out and he has different shoes for different reasons and different outfits, that's fair. Um, so they got him a little shoe rack. How appropriate. I just think that's so cute for him to put his shoes on. So he's now helping a customer, which he feels bad because he's wearing like a t-shirt and jogger pants and tennis shoes. But they just kind of got busy and he just has the instinct to help people. So I'm just going to sit back here for a minute and watch TikTok. I kind of want breakfast, but I also like have been doing good not eating in the mornings. So if we can just hurry and go home, I won't. But we might also see if there's another errand we can run, something else we can do to make it worth our time. Not that it wasn't worth our time to come up here for our friend, but um, it's just a little bit of a distance to come. <laughs> um, so we'll figure something else. So guess what just happened? When Jason was helping a customer, they returned the exact shoe that I need. I know it's a return for him, but they literally returned the very shoe we were going to order for me. Look at that. They're perfect. Should I wear them? I don't want to wear them today because I'm hot. But I'll wear them around the house. That's the rule. Wear it around the house first. Make sure it works so you can still sell it. That's comes my day off. I know it is. <laughs> And it's disposal time. Ours finally gave up the ghost after my fix. And that it's lasted. Well, we haven't ever replaced it. And we've had the house for 11, almost 11 years. We moved in when Ashley was two months old. So I think 10 and a half years is a pretty good life. I mean, we don't know when they put it in. I bet it came with the house. So it's, it's, definitely, it's, it's definitely gotten its use out of it. So now we're just trying to find the right one. And we don't even actually know if the new disposal is going to fix the problem, correct? What do you mean? What do you mean? I don't know. There's no, like, it doesn't even... Breaker. You check the breaker? Check the breaker. Right? Just it doesn't even... Case, <coughs> just in case we'll plug something else into the outlet. But I don't think the outlet was bad. Okay. <coughs> the motor, they, I talked with Abby. I think they left it on and the motor was, like, stuck. And so oh. it just burned the motor out. Okay. All right, we're coming back to look at more selection of disposals. And we're gonna do a, I'm gonna do a little experiment. We're gonna do a separate video for Jason putting it in this disposal. I wanna see, like one, it's great lighting here. It's great lighting in the lighting section. Um, I wanna see <laughs> what this disposal video does in comparison to like one of my Hawaii videos, which given my daily life is a lot less exciting than our Hawaii trips. So just curious. Because the other video, his other disposal video, is up to 80,000 views. Um, so I'm just curious <laughs> what we, what this one will do. Um, I'm going to check it like in a day, and then like a week, and then a month. We'll just see how it does oh, over time, awesome. and see if it does better than a stupid Hawaii video. <laughs> but he's talking to his brother right now. As soon as he's off, we're going to start filming a disposal video. We're going to put them both up at the same time. Um, when I put this video up, this one, his disposal video will go up at the same time. So you get, get a little twofer if you are curious and see how a disposal gets installed. Stay tuned. 
He just farted <laughs> and looked behind him to make sure that there's no one behind him. <laughs> I'm trying to decide if, um, I don't know, I just saw this little shelf right here and it would look good in my downstairs bathroom. But I'm also like struggling with Ashley on cleaning herself up. So I'm kind of thinking maybe that something that's huge. I know that one is. Something but with doors that can shut. Because she I uses think, uh, the downstairs bathroom as her bathroom. I should film. She uses the downstairs bathroom as like her bathroom and where she gets ready every single day, all day, every day. And it's just so gross. And I need to teach her, like she knows how to clean, she knows how to organize, she knows how to like put her, she doesn't actually know how to put her stuff away. And I'm just sick of so it. So we should, like we should measure kids. the space. I know, I know. I let's measure, let's figure out, let's not randomly just buy stuff. I know. But I wouldn't mind something small like this, but maybe with, covered doors on it. So I'm gonna look into it. We just it. have to have the room for it. Oh my gosh, we already have a shelf in the bathroom. I know, but we have to see how deep it is. I don't think that other one's it's, that deep. Yeah, it's like, it comes out from the wall like this. When have you ever, like when is it bothered? You're, you don't I even know. I know, but is that it, six inches bothered. or is that eight inches? Oh my gosh. I don't know, is it? <laughs> <laughs> I can tell you what it is. <laughs> it's not eight. <laughs> We're filming. I just got so, in the lane. I just so we we you know we're kind of gonna go home and then she just gets in this lane to turn right. left and she's all of a sudden talking and she's just like wait where no, are we going? No, you asked me where we were going. No, no, you just all of a sudden out of the blue were like wait why are we in this lane? I'm driving. And I was like I assumed you're getting a coke, and you had no <laughs> idea. Your body just <laughs> naturally you're like Pavlov's dog. And he's like well get out of the lane like get in the other lane to go home. And, uh, and I was like, no, it sounds good now. <laughs> You're so trained. McDonald's has you trained. You can't even control your actions anymore. But to be fair, it's like two o'clock. So what does that have to do with it? I've gone a long time. <laughs> <laughs> so that makes it okay. You, you, didn't, not, you don't even realize. One of these days you're just going to go through the drive thru and you're like, wait a sec, how did I get here? Well, they're going to be like, what are you doing here? The sad thing is they're going to be like, hey, Dana. <laughs> Because they know my name now because of the app. No, no, it's not because of the app. Well, they know my name because of the app, yes. They yes. recognize who they I recognize am. They recognize who you are. They're very nice. I'm sure you're they're one They're very of, nice. You're one they're, of, they're nice. You're not. I'm sure you're one of many ladies that can't even control their actions. They just instinctively drive to McDonald's. Okay, let's go get it, hun. They know what a six inch Coke is. <laughs> and that, my friends, is a man. He just wants me to clarify every time he does manly chores. And he cleaned underneath my sink. Yep. Yes. Yep. And we have the in sinkerator fully installed underneath our sink. Brand new. Brand new disposal. Pretty pretty. So it's always fun filming videos with him. So hopefully you enjoy that video as well. Um, and I don't think it brings other people to my channel because most people that are looking for a very specific video like how to change your disposal really stick around for mom content but if you came for that hi welcome my name is dana <laughs> and everyone else welcome our new followers if they come to it from this video um okay we have dedicated the next um two hours to ourselves right you have to go and actually scare people at the haunted forest and i have to go in about an hour and a half later to be scared so, um, we're gonna sit and do nothing for the next, me for two hours. Um, I actually might start um, editing this video, but he's probably gonna lay down on the ground and take a nap, which is well deserved. I'm not gonna take a nap. You can, but you can rest. All I'm saying is that you're free to rest. I'm not hey, even telling you. Thank no, you. I'm not giving you permission. <laughs> it's all right, all right, I'll embrace my sacred loneliness. Uh, Okay, I have two extra gaggles. <laughs> you recognize one of them. <laughs> you are a gaggle! Okay. okay, okay, so um, we're here to do the haunted house and we have to catch a shuttle. Oh, it's right there, we gotta go. Hurry, we gotta go. We gotta go, we gotta go. Go get the shuttle. Okay, so we, that, that shuttle was full. 
Um, but there's another bigger shuttle coming and I just confirmed with the driver because I know her. <laughs> there's no one on the shuttle to scare us this time. We were kind of worried about that because well, last time there was like a guy with a mask on the shuttle. Dad was on a shuttle. Girl, yeah. Okay, so we're just going to sit here and wait um, for the next shuttle to come back and get us. Um, so I have two extra girls. One of them I think is going to be scared. Yes, you. Oh, I do not get scared. No, but you were getting a little nervous when I said that there was going to be someone on the shuttle. Yeah, because I don't want a creepy so dude. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Except for it's probably going to be my dad if my dad. Knows. Okay, so if you want to stay tuned, I will film and, and show you guys some of the haunted house. But then I will quickly post a whole video of the whole thing um, on the same day. Like, you're going to get a lot of videos <laughs> coming out here really soon. Because he's using the actual video for their website. So, wish us luck. Okay, Ashley, final words. Put my phone away. I'm gonna die. No, you're not filming. I'm not dropping it. I'm not breaking it. Give me my Ashley, camera. Give it back. Ashley, it's your Give me camera back. You ready for this? Well, I know all of this fake. They ran away. I'm probably just gonna die. <laughs> oh, they're playing the Shiner Stranger Things music. Can you please hold my hand? Oh, hi. I don't like, there's a freaking wolf. <laughs> and a baby. It's a baby. There's someone no! <laughs> that's Jason. <laughs> yeah, that's Jack. Yeah. Go, go. You gotta cover up your Hawaii shirt. Yeah, I need to get water. Go, go, go. Oh, wait, let me I don't wanna, yeah, it's gonna be slippery. Don't, don't run. Okay, yeah, get the one, yeah. I actually can't see. Okay. Okay, gross. I'm just gonna have to leave this on. Can you just hold my hand, please? Ella, can you come and hold out Ella. Elizabeth's hand? Like, this must be expensive. Me, I don't think. Feel something other than that bell. Whoa! I'd be. What the? That's Elizabeth. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's a detector. That's my newer detectors. <laughs> no, it's not. That's I know who that is.